and let's see if we can get into that lake. If we can, there's three more pieces in the lake. If not, which I don't think we can, but we'll see. If not, then we'll quote unquote fast travel. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to. Look at that just wall of ice. What happens if we bump into it? Bump. Nothing. We skate off it. Dang. I was kind of hoping that, you know, we'd be able to just cruise through it. Yeah, I don't think we're going to make it to the through the ice flows. So, yes, I want to go to the nearest deembarkation point, which ironically is the Burning Limestone Cave. Okay, now that I have Tolton with me, do we want to run back through here real quick and get that seal? I think we do. Uh, there's more stuff here. <laughs> oh, do we play cleanup now? Yeah, this whole place is melted now. It used to just be a sheet of ice. All right, well, here's that save point. So we at least know that's there. So we'll come back to that here in a minute or two. But let's, let's go get this. Uh, let's see what this actually does. Yep. Tilts us over, throws us off, and now we have to walk really, really slowly. I had a feeling, and I didn't want to do it when we were running through here initially. So. Jeez. All right. Up here, back around we go. Well, that's fine. Or not fine. I didn't see where the path went up. Let's take him down. Wow. Forgot Kaim had a sword. All right. Well, uh, we know how to kill these guys now. They're going to be super annoying, but we know how to do it. So let's go bird. Bird. They're wind. So we need fire. Fire, fire. And you actually give me an aqua on one of these bad guys. Ah, she went first. Oops. Forgot to equip rings. Jeez, that hell dive does a lot of damage. I think it's I think the hell dive itself is designed to put you in a critical status. I think that's what it's designed to do. Unfortunately. Okay. Uh we need equip. Give me... You need a flare ring. So you can attack the bird. You need a water wing. Which was... The stream ring? Yeah. 
and you can attack this dude. Then she... She and Sarah go first. So I actually want to white magic Zephyr. You can be the one to get him. And white magic Zephyr. Yeah, had we done that first, we would have been better. Oh, thanks. I appreciate that. She's going second now? Oh, I think I knew that. Okay, so Jensen's faster than Sarah. Sarah's Sarah's slow. Sarah's last. Only because she doesn't know anything yet. Ten, yes. And we're getting some more levels. All right, so we got accessories, turn tail, black staff, and defense boost. This black staff... They could equip Jensen's specific staves. Yes. Okay. We're going to leave Ming's skill link. But we're going to update her turntail shoes to the power bangle. We're going to update your holy knight to the mimet ear. And you guys are still wake, working on your awakening and sorcerers. Oh, oh. Jeez. Oh, it hurts everybody, everybody. I didn't expect that to be that much. Otherwise, I would have uh, done that differently. But that's all right. We're out of that goo. So now let's get through the second piece of this. <laughs> oh, yeah. let's get it on. Uh, all right. Except now we can actually take out these killer birds. Because I know what I'm doing again. Okay, so you're going to do black magic Flara. You're going to do black magic Flara. And you get to do black magic Aqua Ra. Uh, yeah, let's do it on that guy. Why is she going first now? Yeah, Helldive instantly just puts you into a critical status. Uh, I kind of want that. How did she go faster than Jensen? Okay. <laughs> that hell dive does a lot of damage. There's so much damage. I did it. A perfect battle. Well, Kaim and Sarah are leveling at the same rate. I was gonna say that should be that should be a decent amount. Alright, so everybody knows two accessories. Seth got three slots, so now I need to finish off Kaim with his three slot. Okay. 
<laughs> now is when things apparently start going a little bit bonkers. So instead of magic defense boost, we're going to go with three slot. We're going to set her. We may as well finish Jensen now that we're here. To absorb transfer. Set your link to absorb transfer. You already know absorb transfer. Great. Oh, she doesn't know anything. <laughs> oh yeah, I need to give I need to set uh, Let's do it instead of weapon guard then. Two accessories. This is definitely going to make things... Wait, did he not learn it? Oh, no, there it is. I was a little worried there for a second. Uh, let's do it instead of MP Max. Two accessories... And mental stability, two accessories. Beautiful. Because now, now we can really power through making sure everybody knows this stuff. There it is, the Gigantus brooch. All right, you're almost done with those. Let's throw the talisman on you. Power Bangle and Lionheart. Treasure Search, we don't care. So we got Knight and... Nope. The Antidote. Cool. Everybody's learning a whole bunch of stuff again. Oh, no. No, no. Uh, equip Ming. Instead of Lionheart, we want the Awakening Bracelet. We need to pass that around quick. And that gives her th three extra, or leap her three slots for now. Okay, I don't have to worry about falling off again, which is good. I didn't realize it was this far back. <laughs> I didn't realize it was this far in here. It is in this cave, though, right? If I remember correctly. That was almost bad. Ooh, there's a chest up here. How did we miss? I'm glad we came back through, but how did we miss this? We get Beast Stone. Cool. That's literally all that's up there. That's how we missed that. Got it. Okay, so we need to go this way. Nope, that just goes up and around. How do we get back up? Is it this way? Hmm. It's not that way. It's not that way. It's got to be this way. Okay, there's a chest there. Can we seriously not go back? Wait, really? We have to go through this from the other side? Alright. Oh, I forgot Seth was highly, highly, highly damaged. <laughs> Completely forgot. Actually, you know what? Let's use the sideline. Heal, uh, two, three, four, and a single Zephyr, double Zephyr. All right, well, we missed another chest, so we got to remember to come all the way back in here again. 
I really was apparently not paying very much attention a little while ago when we came through here the first time. So let's run out. I was hoping we could go backwards, but I guess we can't. Oh, I think I'm gonna like this. Well, hello. Are you in the front? No, you're in the back. All right. Kill the birds. Kill the other bird. All right, what are you? You are organic, hardened, no element. So let's just use a flara on you. And what are you? You're earth. Earth is wind, so let's just use a wind on you as well. And we'll see, we'll see where things fall. Goodbye. Oh, so we could kill those birds if we crit on each one. That's really nice to know. Of course she goes first. Really, guys? Really? That's fine. The attack should be... I was going to say, Seth's attack should be faster than this. All right, who leveled? Kaim and Sarah. Well, the nice thing is coming back in here, we're getting the levels evened-ish back out. Absorb transfers done. Level four black magic on Kaim and attack boost one on Ming. <laughs> All right, so absorb transfer is done. So let's do Black Staff for those that are next. I think you already are doing Black Staff. Yeah. All right. And then Sorcerer's Earrings. I'm still going to go down because there's going to be these ones in the middle. Good. Cool. I'm not going to run back out on this bridge because I'd slide off. I'm always ready. So what are we dealing with? Oh, we got one big bird in the back. And it is actually in the back? It is actually in the back. Hardened organic, huh? Beast Machine Bio. So we'll go Bio here. And then we either need Bio and or Hardened. Preferably at level 2. It's Machine and Magic. Fire 2, Machine Seal. There's a Bio 1. Honestly, our damage up and crit up might be better than any level one, unless there's a, unless there's a, I don't think I have a hardened and and organic. Yeah, we don't. So I'm just going to leave your flare ring on. You are also going to attack this first guy. And then we've got a spell, black magic. Let's do Flara on two. Let's get a... Nope, let's get a Aquara on the... Oh, no, you... Yeah. I guess it doesn't matter, but put that on C. Ha-ha! I finally got stuff right. Nice. I know it's not killing them, but it does a good enough chunk of damage. Was the bird not in the back? It was actually in the front? Interesting. As long as you leave Seth and Kaim alone, we're good. 
Because they'll just kill you. Like this. In like this. Of course, we're going to be five minutes. <laughs> Why do some of these episodes just keep going forever and I should... I really should just stop at 30 minutes. Ugh. All right. Because now we get to change out more equipment. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, he didn't have crisis defense? Yeah, this is this is starting to plow through those a whole lot faster. That's really nice. Are oh, you kidding me? I bet when we come out of the fight, it's going to knock us into the air and do some damage. Oh, hello birdies. Uh, I know how to deal with you. Attack. You. Flara. That one. You. Was it Aqua, bro, we need on the back? No. It's... Wind. It's wind. Yeah, it's wind. Yes. Wow. See? What did I said about them just taking them out in one shot? If, if, if we could get perfect. So we took this group out in in one one go round. Nice. They are definitely catching up. And more. <laughs> I love it. I absolutely love it. All right. So if we go skill Ming, and I know this is going to use an empty slot. It should work, though. Because it is a net gain of two slots. So we should only lo we should lose one slot. But we'll see. Alright. Equip Seth. Oh, Seth actually learned both. Even better. And we do have level six. Alright, I need to get those rolling around, too. Six and five. Beautiful. You did learn one. Give me the awakening. All right. So you have plus three. Did I not put plus three on you? Am, is, is, is my brain wrong? Did you not learn plus three? Jeez. Wait. How does this work? How did it work that I put it in the extra slot that it gave me and I still have three slots? Because if I empty this... <laughs> uh, Alright, we're going to put it in place of Absorb for now. We're going to put Absorb right back on, but I wanted, I wanted to make sure I wasn't, you know, going crazy. Now I'm going crazy. There it is. All right, absorb magic, absorb attack, because those are really, really, really useful. And do we want mental stability? No, we want MP up. And then here, I'm going to leave this one empty. We want mental stability. And lucky magic zero. I can't believe Kaim doesn't have the 
freaking slots. That's just ridiculous. Yep, see? Wait, what just happened? <laughs> y'all y'all saw that, right? Where I just walked through it? And I get up and not slide down. Oh, excellent. All right, how hard are we? Oh, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. Well, we got one extra treasure chest. We got a whole bunch of fights. And we got the one piece of loot that, that was up here. Uh, I don't think that was worth 20 minutes. Although at this point, we're at 50. So I may just break this into two episodes and just not have an intro. So let's save. And uh, I am going to end this episode off here. Hope you folks have enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing and checking out some of my other content. And as always, I will catch you folks in the next episode. Stay frosty out there.